Hey guys, this is the only lot that did not sell <clears throat> out of all the lots I've sold um, in the last couple of months. So, I dropped the price down another $5 and I'm selling it for $18 shift in this padded mailer right here. And this is uh, geared more toward planner girls um, because they are smaller scale stamps and a lot of them are planner related as well. Um, there are some smaller ones too that aren't planner related but... Um, or travel themed, I should say that too, like if you're doing a travel journal. Um, so, here we go. I'm just going to go through them again real quickly. Some more travel themed ones. This is like a girl boss. Heidi Swap. Just pause the video if you want to see a close-up of these. Um, this Happy Meal. Um, and then the Waffle Flower, another Happy Meal. This is a craft related one. This is the Frank Garcia food, I think. Yeah, food and travel. And there are all the stamps right there. Again, if you want to pause it just to see. This Unity stamp. This is a vacation themed one. Again, travel. This is rubber stamps. Don't remember who made these. Um, these have coordinating dies as well that cut out. Um, and then I have these Prima stamps, ma mainly Prima stamps anyway, from here up. Then a couple of Unity stamps and a dollar spot stamp right here with the owl. These are all Prima from Cigar Box Secrets and the Springtime and I don't even know, another Flower Garden, I don't remember. And then these are mainly, oh, this is kind of a combination. So this is Michael's Dollar Spot Prima. All of these are Prima. And um, Hobby Lobby right here. Okay, so that's lot number one, $18 shipped. Bear with me a minute. I get everything packed back up. I don't edit my videos, you guys, because that's just too much work. <laughs> so <laughs> that's why I do a lot of this on camera as opposed to editing my videos so you don't have to see all this crap. But Okay, so that's lot one. Oh, if you want any of these lots, just look down below. Use the drop down below. It has the instructions. I'm disabling comments, so just message me through my personal email with the lot number that you want and your PayPal email address. Don't assume that you're, I'm not going to assume that the email address that you're emailing me from is your PayPal email. So if you want it, just claim the lot with the email address. Don't ask me if it's available. If it's available, I'll invoice you and um, please pay promptly. Otherwise, I'll let you know somebody else claimed it. So, okay, that's just the rules of doing this D stash. Lot number two is gonna be $24 shipped. Um, 14 of this is just the shipping, um, but this is geared more toward people who like doing swaps. Um, at one time, I was gonna get more involved in swaps, and honestly, I just don't have time. I just don't have time for doing that kind of stuff, so. What we've got here is packaging supplies for doing swaps. So I have got all of these organza bags. So I have them in gray, and there's a ton in here, you guys. So I have it in this larger size right here, and then there's also a smaller size. And then I also have some black velvet bags. And I don't know how I'm gonna get this back in here in this box, it is crammed. Um, and then I have it in this copper color. So again, this there's a lot in here, you guys. These copper bags. Um, and then the smaller ones. No, these are all just organza. thought that was velvet, but they're all the organza. So if you do vintage swaps, this is a good one. A good color to use. And then I also have the pink. So this is the larger. And then the little smaller pink organza bags. 
Um, I just have these Dollar Tree ones. I'm sticking that in there just to fill the top. I believe these are some more Dollar Tree ones. I can't remember. This might be Hobby Lobby, actually. Um, but it's that lace. These lace um, treat bags. Um, I have these Matchbox matchboxes that I got from the dollar spot at Michael's. These treats and bags. Oh, of course my phone would go off. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Okay, I couldn't hit ignore, so I'm just letting it go. Um, and then these treats and bags from Hobby Lobby. These clips from the dollar, dollar Spot. These from the Dollar Tree. I think that's from, uh, yeah, Dollar Tree. Ugh, making a mess. Um, these bags right here. Um, it's like a Marie Antoinette themed. Um, so Parisian. So you've got the bags, these little toppers, and then some little um, tissue. These right here, these treat bags, they have the cutout window with the acetate over the, I think there's 10 of them in there. Uh, these from the Dollar Tree. Some more from uh, Joanne that are French themed. Oh, there's the patterns right there. These from Walmart. From the Dollar Spot. I'm sorry, Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. Um, Hobby Lobby, these are sacks. There's two patterns, so the stripes and the circles. Um, the rose gold ones from the Target dollar spot. Um, this one is, there's the bags right here. And then you also get the little clips. Um, also with the little flags that say XOXO. Uh, some more of those from the Dollar Tree. This cute little one left over that I had from Walmart. Some more favorite bags from Joanne. Some more little sacks from Hobby Lobby. I uh, This is the Kane Company. Uh, I can't remember the name. Anyway, um, the typecast. These are glassine um, envelopes. And these little sacks that say, uh, thank you, thank you, the, I can't read this, the happy chance to see you. Oh, thanks for the happy chance to see you. Hello. <laughs> okay, so these, that have the little cute little bow and the little polka dots. And then these, there's all kinds of different patterns in this one with these little cellophane bags. Okay. Sorry for the interruption on that with my phone. Lot number two, 24 shipped.